Mt. Gox was the largest Bitcoin exchange and in 2013 at its peak accounted for 70% of all Bitcoin transactions. However, they had a track record of getting hacked and losing Bitcoin at several occasions and trying to artificially manipulate the numbers in their record books. On February 2014, Mt. Gox suspended all trading and went offline. The company declared bankruptcy after 744,000 bitcoins were stolen which amounts to 35 million at that time and billions of dollars today. There were two primary suspects in this case. First one was Mark Karpilis, the founder of Mt. Gox, but after a thorough investigation by Japanese authorities over an year, he was proven innocent. The second suspect was Alexander Winnick, a Russian. He worked with BTCE, Russian exchange. The US authority traced 90% of stolen Bitcoin to a wallet that he controlled. He was ultimately charged with money laundering. He was involved in the money laundering. However, US authorities still couldn't find out who stolen those bitcoins. And there was another shocking revelation. Around 850,000 bitcoins were stolen from Mt. Gox over a period of four years and there is still no trace who stole them. It's still a mystery. Yeah, yeah, yeah.